to share with you this transmission. If you want to see past the third dimensional reality, then your only hope is to buy a channel reading with the indigo child. The only indigo child sludge to get rid of, which is another reason why you can book a channel meeting with the indigo child. Otherwise, make sure to buy the book, Teachings from God, because it's the only way for you to tap in to the energy of the 12th dimension, to really Free yourself into your most highest living. That's it. That's the only transmission that I'm getting. So take that in. Just allow that message to really move through your body. I just happen to have actually a copy right here to show to you that this is the book that came through to me from the divine. Um, I just challenge you to read this book and to see that I really accelerated a lot. For example, a human being who struggles is often experiencing a shift that is exceptionally hard to break, for they experience many lifetimes of chaos, self-destruction, great crises, and even an innumerable amount of human killings. So if you can't understand this book, then it's probably because you murdered somebody in a past life and in that case I would again um, invite you not because I'm forcing this on you but when you tune into your heart and feel your truth and your essence then you'll know that it's time to book a reading with me or to buy my book or both because um, that will help you a lot and it will also help me but I don't need money I just it's just my karmic, it's my dharma, it's my dharma to share the love and money doesn't matter to me at all. I just, I just, I just want to help people, so. So it says, just remember that you have a long ways to go. You are a child of God, but you also have a long ways to go. Enlightenment is not a journey, but it is a race and it's a race against yourself and your physical reality is going to kick you in the butt but that's not what it says but that's what it means so just remember tell your friends you are the creator of your reality just remember to tell your friends you are the light you are the oneness and when you have pain and struggles then just remember, it's a race, and you better see your ego now before it's too late. So, if you want to do that, buy my incense from the Himalayans. I am an indigo child, and so basically what that means is that I vibrate at a really high frequency. In the case that you are not operating on that level you are only on the third dimension or the second dimension and the first dimension or even 0.5 of dimension then all you're going to see is a human flesh and in case that's how you're seeing me right now through this video then I just I send light and love to you and I send energy to you and I will keep you in my I will keep you in my heart and in all my chakras. If you have anything that is not white in your house, then I would I would strongly urge you to get rid of it because black things attract black energy into your house. So if your pet is colored black, then I would just say, remind you, like maybe donate them to someone else, especially somebody that has, you know, you want to gain revenge on you. Just say, here's my puppy, and I know you'll love it, but you secretly know that you're going to be putting that black energy into their house. So, the other thing that you can do if 
if you don't know how to, to work on the multicellular level yet, to the DNA level yet, you can use certain energy type of works, you know, like Qigong and Reiki and, and uh, you know, I don't do that anymore, but I don't need to anymore, but in case you are, you know, you can use the, you can use the Qigong called sore fingers and you just go, and it works really well, especially if you're in public or if you're going, if you're driving your car um, or your unicorn or whatever you use, you know, and they're in the way for you that you just like that. And they might get out of the way or they might not in case you're not very good at doing it yet. But for me, it always works. So in case, you know, you see some chaos happening on the road, then it might have been me. Namaste, I forgive you. I really loved giving you all my information and I hope you can really see how important it is to, you know, keep following my wisdom because I'm the only one left really in, in, in the world that is an indigo child. They all got older and they're not they're not indigos anymore. So I'm still I'm still in human years pretty pretty low on the scale, so so it's pretty amazing how far I've come, you know. And so if you can feel that at your DNA level that I know that you have some something worth worthwhile, you know. But in the case that you're not sure about me or about my level of awakening then just follow that up with me i'm okay with that namaste